Hello YouTube, my name is Trey, welcome to What Can I Change? Today we're going to be talking about principles. So, would you go to your son's marriage if it was a gay marriage? Let's go ahead and answer that question. But before we do that, if you like this video and you want to subscribe towards the end, hey, that's cool. If you don't, cool. If you want to help, you know, get, you know, help, you know, donate to the channel. We put all our money back into the production. As y'all seen, we've been making improvements over here. Appreciate y'all. All right, that's it. All right, to the video. We're getting married in a month's time. And I was coming to see whether you guys would come. Well, Chris, um, you know I've got very strong beliefs on, on that situation. Mm -hmm. So um, for us, that's not an option. Okay. okay. What are your beliefs? Basically the same, different reasons. Okay. We love you, but we really don't want to be part of that. And we'd like you to respect that. Right. Okay. And I know that's probably hurting you, but yeah. if you're honest, you would have expect you would have expected that. Yeah. So you think it's worth sacrificing your relationship with me because of your beliefs? I don't want to get into a argument with you. So I, um, I just need to know, I need to know because over the past 18 years I have not called on you when I've needed you and it would be really good, it's like it, it would be really nice if you could be there. We can't. Okay. Well, that's disappointing. I know, I know. You can choose all of me, or you can oh, choose none of me. Okay. Well, if that's the way it's got to be, that's the way it's going to be. Okay. Cool. Okay. I've got principles that I've lived by my whole adult life, and I'm not going to change them just because of how he wants to live his life. I don't want that in my life, and that's not going to change. I want to say this because some people when they talk about people on camera do some people play to the camera yes but understand when these shows happen right and I'm, I'm sure this is the older clip but nonetheless when these shows happen and I could say from a person who's been on camera you know um it doesn't feel like you're on camera until you see yourself right on the tv show when they make these shows it may be a year before the show even airs that's why they can do those quick turnarounds with the reunion that way they, that's why they can be like, all right, guys, welcome to my own back. And it's been a whole year since the show has even aired, right? So they aired the show, and it's been a year since those people have even been on the camera. It doesn't feel like a camera's really there. You know, it just, like, I talk, I'm talking to this camera right now. Yes, I'm talking to it, but it doesn't feel, like, different. I like, I'm not acting any different than I normally would, right? I don't know. I don't know if that makes any sense, but I, I think this was sincere, meaning I don't think they were just playing up to the camera. It's hard to do that because you're not going to see that you're not. And sometimes shows don't get aired at all. They, they'll tell you that. They'll be like, hey, you know what? Hey, we're going to put you on film and this may never happen. You'll never see this video ever. I've done interviews and they never you will never see them because they never happen. So it just you just be natural. So I think this is what they naturally feel. So what I want to say about this. I agree, obviously. Why would I... Some people think this... Some people may think that this is not right. You know, it is your son, it is your daughter, or whatnot. And that doesn't change anything for me. My faith and what I believe don't change for nobody but me and God. That's it. And so if I don't agree with that marriage, I'm not a going. I'm not a going. I'm not going. And I, I like how he says, would you be willing to sacrifice your relationship with me? Yep. <laughs> Absolutely. Absolutely. Because at the end of the day, y'all got to understand how deep people's faith runs, right? When we talked about that video earlier, uh, probably what, two months ago now, I made a video on a, a individual who was a Muslim and they don't shake hands, right? They don't shake hands with women. They don't shake hands with people of the opposite sex and no circumstances, unless you're a family member. Unless you're a family member, dang near, right? If you ain't the mother, grandma, sister, something in that area, you're not getting your hand shaken because they truly believe that, because it says, Allah says, it is better 
you you would burn in hell. I'm not. I don't know verbatim, but you would burn in hell, shaking a person of the opposite sex hand because it can lead to immorality. That's why they don't do it, right? Paraphrasing. Go watch my video. I have it completely laid out better than this, but nonetheless, that's how deep their faith runs. So they're not shaking hands. And if somebody said, "Would you be willing to sacrifice your relationship with me?" Yep. They're not playing about it, because even the guy I was watching said, "Would I rather do this or go to hell?" Hmm. Well. It, is it really a question? Is it even, why are we even asking this? I'm not doing it. So I, I obviously agree with the parents. I would not do anything that goes against my morals just to have a relationship with somebody to feel better on a camera. Just because somebody's watching on camera, you're going to judge me. I don't care. <laughs> that ain't got nothing to do with me. That's between you and your life. If I'm not going to the game, I don't have to be a part of that. See, and this is the thing I always say. Because if they were, if his parents were gay and he was a religious man and he said, can you come to my, uh, come to my wedding here at my uh, church? And they said, no, people would probably be fine with it. They'd be like, oh yeah, I mean, that makes sense. Oh uh, yeah, because they're gay. I mean, they don't believe in Jesus and they don't believe in that. They, everybody be cool with it. But because he's gay and they're religious, this is the whole thing of, this is why I hate the religious people. My parents and, okay, fine. You know what? I'm just to the point in this life. It's like, you know what? I'm not going to sit here every single day. And be thinking like, oh, yeah, I know your parents were religious. They hated you clearly and they hate everything about you. Yeah, that's true. I'm tired of having that argument. I'm tired of believing that. I have grew up with a bunch of people religiously and most of them walked away not because of their parents. Most of them walked away because of their own uh, volition and they got into their own thing. But their parents are still the same people that I knew growing up. Obviously, I don't know the complete inner workings of relationships between parents and all that because y'all don't know mine. But at the same time, to say that because your parents were religious means they hate you and they judge you, it's just that why can't they live? The, you and your parents aren't the same people. You understand that, right? You were born into the family. They're going to train you and teach you the way that they believe is true, right? But when you grow up and you become a man or a woman, that's you. That's you, and they're them, you know? And so I, I always disagree with people always blaming their parents for every little thing that happens to them. Obviously, there are things that are abusive and stuff like that. But in this case, in this case, let your parents be who they are. They are not an extension of you. You know what I mean? You're an extension of them. So do what you want in this life. Live the life you want to live. Um, you know, in the end, we'll all see. But. Yeah, I agree with the parents, man. You, I'm not going to a gay marriage. For me personally, I wouldn't go to my friend's gay marriage. If I had a friend who was gay, where they came out to me as gay and said, can you come to marriage? I'd be like, no, I don't believe in that. You know, that's not where I stand. I believe marriage between a man and woman. And I, hey, you got quarrels about it? Hey, that's between you and you. I'm still not coming. You know, because if it was the, the roles were flipped, how would you feel? Hmm. Okay. Anyway, let me know what you guys think. I'm out.